All right then, so let's keep going. You know, it seems like if I click over here, like, you know, someone has clicked on this stuff over here, it's a little watch out for that, but whatever. I think I'll have to make another save for this mission. Before it gets complete, but whatever. Yes, Vengeance is near. They're healing up nicely, I guess. I should probably actually send a thief around here to, like, you know, check out stuff, so... Let's get this thief, thief basically out and away. Alright, that looks like fun. Oops. Alright, so, my guy got a little bit injured in like the last fight here. Mm -hmm. My spells are right here, I guess. Now here's a question, by the way. I don't actually research Stone Rain, I don't think, so... Is it actually worth it to like, you know, research this or is it just worth to like get the gold? I'm gonna say it's probably worth to get the gold, so... Let's acquire all the spells here. That's basically it for down here, I guess, so... Start going this way? I am here to please. You're having fun there. Annihilate. They're all nice and alive. You know, it seems kind of wasteful doing this, but I'm actually gonna get Thief to go over here and like, you know, check this out as well. Yeah. And I say it's wasteful because I really don't really need to send like a Thief basically up here to like, you know, Do this. I could send like a skeleton or something like that. Yeah. Master. But whatever. I guess we could sell this off. He's just got orbs in here by the looks of it. He's got like, you know, orb of healing, orb of restoration, orb of life. I mean, orbs are interesting, but, you know, the fact that they actually take a turn, like, you know, for your heal to use them, they're not that useful. That's the only thing I'm about to say about them, really. They could be more useful if, like, you know, they didn't have that, like, you know, problem with them, I guess. What to hit, what to hit. The lightning scroll. Probably should grab that first, but whatever. I'm trying to go after these guys here, by the way, but because the archers will go first, they'll kill off this guy here, so... It's not really in my best interest. So let's push on. Eh, I guess I'll probably just wait to heal those guys fully up. Who must die? Eh, let's just go for it. We'll hit this up. They're of course going to go for my spectre there, but whatever. You're going to defend, just in case. Oh, 
Well, I didn't need this guy to defend, but you know, whatever. Very safe than sorry. Spectre's now level 4, so 72% chance to paralyze. Be nice this guy got to level 5, but you know. I don't think we'll get that lucky. Anything. Goblins and these guys over here. They will fall. Let's drop some poison on those guys right there, so we're hoping up the way to get through them. Anything. Alright, well, is it the ruin? Alright, that's a scary, like, you know, finna fight. There's an Imperial Knight in there, as well as two Imperial Assassins and a Mage. I'll probably need my main party to fight that because it's a little bit too, like, you know, overpowering, I think, for my guy to fight right there. Yes, Master. What? Who must die? Yeah. Who must die? Could I fight that, I wonder? I'm tempted to take on a city, but you know. These guys aren't necessarily that powerful, so. They will suffer. Let's take this guy up here first. Ouch. That was a little painful. I have to say, I do like the amount of Golem actually getting it like, each time, like, you know, a turn progresses. It's very nice. Alright, those guys are nice and, like, you know, Who must die? Andrew for me to take on. They will suffer. We'll pop this guy first. There goes the Orc uh, Champion. Triple kills. We'll slow this guy way up here now. I am here to please. You know, it's worth knowing, but I, I can't weaken you guys basically outside of any two of like, you know, spells, so that is always like, you know, an option for me basically like to pursue. We'll stay away from that though. Let's take these guys busy on. Ow. We're just gonna defend. Defend. Magra. That was painful. Defend. Magra. And of course this guy gets missed, so whatever. There we go. To be honest, if I got this guy basically up to level 3, and this guy up to like level 3, and maybe the Warlock up to level 3, I probably won't get the Warlock up to level 3. They're ready to go, I think, so. You know, I've got extra like spell power of like room managers, so I can basically drop this stuff off a little bit, so. Let's drop Blizzard on this guy here a little bit. Ouch. Bend. Of course I missed that. We 
dead anyway, so let's fight. And of course, that's the little, like, the one that needs more experience, but whatever. At least we got a second Templar, so hooray for him. You're done. Your desires, precious lord. I swear I'm not actually gonna steal from them if I want to, but you know. I was like worth doing by his ball. I guess I send this guy out to like, you know, soften him up with poison as well, so I could do that. Let's get you over here, I guess. As you wish. Get you over here. That's probably enough thieves. I am here to please. Now, honestly, I should probably send him back to, like, you know. Guard to pass, so speak, so... Could probably do that with him right now. We'll sell that off. Master. Whoop, these guys are hostile. So this does give me an opportunity to wipe out these like arches over here. Why don't I always wipe out his party? It's more of a nuisance party than anything else, so whatever. We'll take that potion restoration. This guy really needs to go heal up, I think, so let's go send him right there. Anything. We're just gonna hover around here. Anything. Your desires yes. They will feel my power. Or a vigor. Well, whatever. Now I don't think there's any shots by the way, besides like you know that, like you know. Um, one right here, down in this area, so, once basically I go up here a little bit, we'll have to, like, you know, backtrack, like, you know, up to the shops and sell stuff, but whatever. You know, thinking about, I could probably, like, you know, oh, whatever, just leave him like this. Annihilate. This should be too tough of a battle over here, I don't think, so let's just take this on. They will suffer. Get this out done out of the way. One hit. Two hits. Three hits. Whoop! They have enough, like, you know, power to actually survive the hits there, so that's kind of annoying. One hit. Knock you out. Knock you out. There we go. What you do here? You all die long ago. We going to kill you all. Nothing in the city, but whatever. You know, I'm, at, I'm at, sort of like tempted to like push on here, so... We could just heal this guy up like so. Just push on. They will suffer. Let's just get this out of the way. Ow. 
And there we go, two more Dark Lords basically load up, so... Pray for that. Who must die? Because he's so close, they're gonna move right back in here, so we can actually heal him up a little bit more, so hooray for that. Yeah. They're fine, let's get up here. Annihilate. Let's grab just a few. A valuable. How oh, nice. Ooh, there's actually um, a gold mine up here I could grab, so. What? We're just gonna make your way up here. What? Actually, gold's always nice to get, even though he's like, you know, Lear fills this chapter. Let's get you in the city for now. Annihilate. Yeah, these guys are injured enough, I guess. I probably just want to go in here, heal them up, and just move out. Uh, so, do so. Anything. Who must die? Alright, so. We're just gonna heal this guy up, I think, and let's move on to these lizardmen to give them their IR fact. I thought this guy would actually, like, you know, do something about that, but okay, guess not. They will suffer. They hit for 91, these guys, so they're a little bit, like, you know, menacing to be hit by, so. This will hurt a little bit. Realize him. Wow, two misses like that. Well, whatever, we killed him off. My prince. Let's get you up here. Let's start softening up the city here a little bit. Gonna poison these guys here a little bit, okay. Hooray, we poison the city. Your desires I don't think these guys are gonna take much damage from that, but whatever, we poison them. Kill for him. Let's go punch those gobs of you, I guess. Who must die? I am here to bleed. Master. Oh, so these guys are active too, apparently. If you're too close. Uh hit this guy. And yeah, this guy hits like so hard that like you know I'll probably kill off my warlock if I go after him. It might still be worth it to go after for the other guys, because I can, you know, get more experience for this guy here and these guys here as well. He's serving away too if he's active as well, so whatever. Let's get some more fees basically out in play. And those guys basically heal up, like, you know, after I poison, so whatever. We're just gonna send a wave of feeds basically over here.
You know, it's funny how this, like, you know, piece of land only have, like, this, like, you know, bit of, like, life man basically, for, for a resource. This is probably, like, the resource I really want over here to that death man, but, you know, I never actually plan to run this, like, area over here. This point out there. Let's get you going this way. What? Makes sense to do this, I think, so. Burn their souls. Let's just do this. Boop. Boop. Two experience for him. Annihilate. Your desires, precious power. So there's a death dragon and a ghost. Master. You know, interestingly enough, I don't think this guy can be harmed by, like, the death dragon, so... I can do this, like, battle here. And only these guys really have to worry about, like, being hit and stuff like that, so... Okay, see, that's nothing either, but whatever. Oh, he's warding against death, this guy, cool. He wins, let's just it's resolve. Get some experience for my guys there. Good experience too. Baron protection, not bad for a baron to find. Yeah, I'm still gonna close up these guys are um interact with me. They're actually like, you know, because there's like a quest here, they'll actually like you know pop come on and say like, you know, hey you got my artifact, you're friends with us. Hey little friend. Annihilate. I suppose I should probably move you over here at this point. You know, something I actually attempt to do here. We're just gonna get a piece of can far right here. If he comes to, like, to attack me with, like, you know, the ghost, and, like, you know, I can probably take him, so it's fine. Like, he'll kill my ghost, basically, but, you know, whatever. I can deal with the ghost, ghost dying. Hit him. You're dead. Uh, you're just gonna wait, I think, because you have more damage. So yeah, we'll wait to... Oop, that was enough to kill this guy. Now this guy's immune to poison, so he won't like, die to this, but you know. This is a big more experience for him to like level up with, I guess. My prince. Master. Alright, so listen, man. Stop. This is the territory of the Shilish tribe. Approach no more or die. The totem. You are nice to us. Thank you. Take this gift. So there's an artifact. Now there's a question, I guess. Do I want to say fight these guys or just move on, I guess? Because I do have time actually to fight them if I want to. I think we will fight these guys. Just gonna drop a couple quick heals on these guys here. The moose will be a fret, but you know. It's good experience regardless. Except this guy. See, the thing is that she can petrify of like 62% chance, so lots of damage from her. Yeah, 
good news is that they all got warped, so like, you know, they won't let us like take in like you know petrification these guys, so that's nice. But he's petrified, he got petrified, I guess. Ow. It's pretty much you. That's the only bad thing, like you're gonna be petrified over and over again. If you're unlucky. And a petrified doesn't necessarily break right away either, so. Trying to save the damage is like, you know, not really working for me, but whatever. Let's go for you. I just want to win because, like, you know, can't do anything else. That was unfortunate, but whatever. I'm just showing, like, you know, how powerful Venusus can be in this game. Poison. Anything. Who must stop? You have to go revive now, I guess, so just do so. Take you back in. I don't really care that ghost so you can just like just sit there. Now, there's no more units basically out here to, like, you know, annoy me with, so... We can send these guys basically all up to, like, you know, sit here. Without a care in the world! Who must die? Just in case we'll send, like, a couple more feeds, though. Oh, if these feasts survive, it's like not like a like you know a detriment to me because I can use them to like you know fight the you know the demons when it comes time for it. There's a push of accuracy apparently, not bad to find. I might actually send her basically trying to like fight some Lizmen. Get some good experience with her that way. Maybe I'll do that. Who must die? Master. My prince. That's a good poison nose like movement right there. He's not yet close enough to like, you know, move all the way to here and back, but whatever. Yeah, annihilate. It's probably a waste to heal a death knight there, but whatever. Get up here. Anything. Get over here. Your desires, precious lord. <sighs> We're almost there to that gold. What? We're just gonna go up here. Who must die? As you will. Who must die? Never. Alright, so. Anything they will fall. Poison. <laughs> Poison. Hooray. Poison. There we go, nice and poisoned up. Cats not poisoned like really like you know hurt them a little bit there, so we'll send these guys toward the wizard, I guess, over here. Uh, uh, 
You're gonna plant your rod right there. Ray, all mine. Vengeance is near. Anything. Oh, we finally failed that, but oh well. Vengeance is near. There's that ruby. Burn their souls. One hit. Uh, you're just gonna defend back there. Defend. We died. You're gonna defend. Hooray! We got ourselves another Templar. That's probably actually enough, basically, for me to, like, you know, up this party a little bit, so... I'll probably have, like, him try and get all the experience now. Master. Resurrect. Resurrect. All my money's gone at this point, so that's a bit of an issue, but whatever. Who must die? Now, before I go in here, Bob, I can actually cast a spell to, like, improve my initiative a little bit, so... Let's do so. They will suffer. Then we'll fight. And... Hit him. Get rid of him. Hit him. She gets to heal everyone, but it's fine. Hey, look at that. We got ourselves a little free Death Knight over here. We are cursed. The Empire could barely rise from its ruins after the first great wars. Why have you come back? Alright, well. Now we have this sea, we have access to this, like, you know, resource here. Which is awesome. I think you go this way now. My prince. My prince. Ah, I must die. I am here to please. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, I'll probably want to get leadership for this guy so he has a little bit more, like, you know, oomph to him. Which means I can have like an extra guy basically in here, so. Master. Not this guy, he's kind of dead, but you know. We can have another guy basically in this part over here. Might as well get our ghost. Give this guy a chance here, I guess, and then we'll just like, you know, Your move on from there. They will fall. It might be good to actually duel the wizards so I can actually injure him that way. They will fall. My god, the failures. They will fall. There we go, finally poison these guys a little bit. Your desires, precious lord. Yeah. Just in case, Sabbath, you go up here. Vengeance is near. You're gonna start coming back over here. Annihilate. I'm not like, could actually try and heal these guys up, but be really expensive to do so. So it's just better to wait a little bit, I think. So. As you will. Master. We'll just wait there a little bit. It might actually make sense to upgrade the city here a little bit. So. There's an upright city button in here. Annihilate. Yeah, right there. Okay, so we're gonna like grow the city there. It'll cost me a little bit of gold, but Master. make them heal a little faster. Yeah. Who must die? Your desires, precious. Your desires, precious. Yes, Master. Who must die? Uh, that's enough basically to heal him up a little bit, I think, so... Quick heals. Turn you up this way. As you wish. Annihilate. Your desires, precious 
Poison. 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 Nice and softened up, so... That'll really soften them up. Who must die? I assume the ghost is probably dead, but you know... They will suffer. We can take these guys on now. And yeah, she's died, but whatever. Boink. 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 Good experience for these guys. I almost got myself a Dark Lord in this party. Ocean of Vigor. My prince. I guess I should probably go after this party down here. I feel like this part is sort of like a waste to go after it, but you know, whatever. Let's get you in here. There's actually treasure back there, apparently. As you wish. Master. Once again, let's just dismiss the ghost here, I guess. There's our ghost. Well, I will kill for the actual experience, I guess, so let's get out of the way. Anything. Anyway, you got you to poison him? We'll see. I think about it, I should probably pick up the items from you there, so let's do that before I forget. There's a Lizardman orb. Is that reduced to that party, so that'll be fun to fight, but whatever. Chance is near. Two over here. Who must die? You know, it probably makes sense to like to be casting like this constantly to like you know buff up my guys a little bit. It might make sense to actually drop some spells on these guys too. So. That's a little bit overkill, I think. You know, it's probably a good time to start, start looking at re researching more spells here, so... Let's get Death Dragon basically researched, so I can basically drop on people. Oh, that takes Runestone Man, I've gotta watch out for that. We're actually, like, using up a lot of Runestone Man here. Now let's just do this. So we just took down or HP or a little bit. Buff up him. They will suffer. One big hit. Ow. Perfect. That's not perfect, but whatever. This will kill me before I had a chance to hit. So there we go, some experience. That's all I'm really doing at this point, is getting more experience for my guys, by the way, so... Yes, what? Let's just keep this going. And let's just, like, you know, for the sake of, like, you know, being completionist in the let's just run over this guy. So there's a lizard right there. So we got a little free like producer here, so he's probably gonna level up from this guy right here. These guys are also pretty like you know close to experience as well, so that's gonna suck for me. I just made myself like level force these guys here. Oh, I didn't. Good. So 
a little bit of like you know experience on those guys there, but whatever. I'm not bothering to basically try to clean up the rest of the map up here because they, they demons will actually start moving out very, very soon, so... It's in my interest to try to clean up as much as possible before, like, they do. I'm just gonna do this guy here. A little bit of extra damage on him. Who must die? I will drop a little bit of damage on my guests like this. They will suffer. Of course, the ghost dies, but you know, that's to be expected. It's really this guy I want to survive, right? So. Kill off him. Kill off him. I should probably make him defend. He just died there as a result of not defending them, but whatever. You're almost up to level 3. Now here's a question, Bobby. There's not a whole lot of basic enemies to fight at this point, so... It's up here after I basically have to go to, like, you know, fight anything else, really. If I want to fight anything else. In Holy Gate over there. <sighs> she has no purpose basically up here at this point, so get down here. Give you this. Move this way. At this point, all my guys are going to start moving up to her, like, you know, this, like, sort of passage up here, so... That's where they're all going to go. Master. I'm tempted to take those guys on, but... I might just wait to, like, you know, get just a little bit more experience, basically. This will help. This will help. But is it worth to get him? This might be useful too, by the way, for the demons. So I might actually want to get this, so we'll see if Rust maybe. Master. Now, here's a question, are these guys gonna pop up to like you know fight me or not? So Drop some stones in these guys here. A little bit of like damage basically on there. Okay, so this might be foolish, but we're gonna take these guys on. And we'll see how it goes. Hit you. Defend. Oh, I made him go after this guy. That wasn't smart. Alright, good. Now, for this guy to, like, you know... I have to paralyze him because, like, you know, if she gets her off her attack, then she's gonna, like, you know, get everyone, so... He unfortunately dies, but whatever. We've won. Oh well, I would have liked to get more experience on like, you know, this guy, but that's fine. I'm just gonna use this basically to drop up on him. I am here to annihilate. Vengeance is near. Alright, so I do have a shop here I can go to. Look at that, it's basically one of these shops right here, of like potions and stuff, so... I could actually like buy this stuff here if I want to. We can sell off like all the stuff I'm not going to use, like the talisman. 
But I may want to save the Tossman for selling, so I'll, maybe I won't sell that. Let's get rid of this. You know, I have to wonder, was this ever, like, useful in this, like, you know, playthrough? I don't think this, like, you know, mission had any, like, barbarous attacks like, at all, so... I think we'll sell off, off a tome. I have a mage bar, I, can, I actually could use this basically to like, you know, weaken up people and save mana. Save the ice storm. Don't care about the orb really, so I can go away. You can go away. 150 really isn't enough, so let's just sell this. That diamond could be worth keeping for like the next one, so... Maybe that sapphire, perhaps as well. I never actually used this apparently, so. Boop! There's some initiative on him, by the way. That'll be useful. So, that gold ring is not worth enough. I don't care about something goblins in battle. We'll find better banners, so we'll sell the banner. We'll sell, find better runestone, so we'll sell the runestone. Still off that orb right there. We'll still this ru 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 ruby and we'll still this like this red thing right here. So this is a little bit of my base to spell out, spend on stuff. I don't really need to have like these type of potions right here because I have like, you know, enough ways to sort of heal my, my guys basically. I mean, that though would be nice. So this stuff over here. I don't really have time because since fees up here is a thing, right? So we're gonna buy stuff. I don't like buying stuff, but this is like you know, one of the few times when it's actually like you know the reason to. I also make sure my guy's basically equipped for like the foul battle here, because I you know forgot to put on stuff on this guy, so. Just stuff here. I should fight those guys, so I'm gonna drop that on him. They will suffer. I'll get the easy experience here, I guess. One hit. Two big hits. They're going after hit this guy, unfortunately, because, like, you know, he's basically the bigger target, so... I'm gonna lose my Death Knight again. And, of course, I get the extra hit there, but whatever. Alright, so there's a level up for a Spectre. It's not quite enough experience to get these other guys leveled up, unfortunately, but whatever. That's fine. That's an okay scroll, but, you know, not really useful for this mission here, so... I'm actually going to sell that scroll, I think. Alright, so... That's basically the delusion basically dealt with up yeah. over here. Who must die? All these guys basically start um, quarrying basically you know, like, you know, my portion of the map, I guess, so... That's their job. Ready up. I probably should research this, so let's just get out of the way. Just to have it. I think she'll be too slow to get where I, where I need her to go, but you know. Whatever. Let's get you up here. Master. So it's gonna take him five turns to get down here. So yeah, I basically have to like book it back now, I guess, for his like you know part yeah. mission. So that'll be his plan. Let's 
get you over here. Master. We can find these guys here. Always keep this guy moving. As you wish. You apparently don't have anything really special there, so that's fine. Just get up here. They will feel my power. Master. Yes. Master. They're slowly like killing up in there, that's fine. Would you be able to be, be like anywhere near here, I guess? You might, so I guess we'll keep you moving this way. I'm literally gonna throw everything to stop they Uber, because, like, you know, this is where things are gonna get more, more difficult to, like, do, so. Yeah. What? I'm gonna basically send up here, so for the most part. You know what, let's do this like different with her. We'll send you base back in here. Annihilate. You guys are heal up enough, so let's just get you up here. Uh, yes, master. Keep going. Vengeance is near. Everything goes basically to her for now. Master. As you wish. Annihilate. Get you up here. Yeah, you can sit right there for now. He's almost basically fully healed at this point, which is very nice, but you know, whatever. Let's get you up here, I think. I will avenge my what? Master. Alright, so, potions and potions and potions. This will go over to you. Scrolls will basically go over to her so she can use them basically in battle. Or before he battles rider. Apparently I only have like two scrolls here I'm gonna like you using apparently, so Oh, five scrolls basically. That's fine. Vengeance is near. Let's get you up here. Master. He'll go right there. Master. Now here's the ultimate question. Do I have time to to like, you know, try and grab a little bit more stuff before like, you know, stuff happens and kicks off? I think like in like five or so turns, that's when like you know, um, Uther is basically gonna move out. So that's really the question. Anyhow, I'm just gonna save the game here because this is basically like you know, just before like you know, Uther basically like you know gets ready to like come out. It's around like six or so, basically decides like you know, make a run for it. We'll see what it basically does, but for now, take care.